Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're unable to load a PDF document in Google Chrome. So if you're receiving an error that says failed to load PDF document and then it says reload in a little option hyperlink right underneath, this tutorial will be for you. So first thing I would personally suggest would be to open up the more settings icon near the top right corner of your browser window. Left click on it one time and then left click on help and then about Google Chrome. So this will load the information page about Google Chrome as well as an auto update or initiator. So it kind of will initiate or trigger an automatic update here. So we're just going to wait for this page to load here and you'll see what I mean if you're unfamiliar with it. So it's going to actually begin checking for updates here. So again, you let this finish updating here. You would likely restart your browser at that point. And hopefully this should have been able to resolve the problem and it should say that we're all up to date. Go ahead and try and open up a PDF again and see if that's resolved the problem. Now, if you're still experiencing a problem here, you can go this time back up to the menu icon, left click on settings. And now you want to scroll down to get to advanced. So scroll all the way near the bottom of the page here. So it's probably gonna be pretty close to the bottom should be something that says advanced, left click on that one time and now you want to go left click on where it says content settings control what information websites can use and what content they can show you and now you want to go to where it says PDF documents so scroll down here click inside of there one time now you want to toggle where it says download PDF files instead of automatically opening them in Chrome. So toggle this to the on position by clicking inside the oval one time. You'll know it's turned on if it is blue, a blue oval with a blue circle at the end of it. And then I would suggest restarting your browser and hopefully you know you should be able to access your PDF files again. So pretty straightforward tutorial guys. I hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.